guys we are here with CL versus I forgot his opponent but this match is all deciding for Indy Scooters versus Avagorn picks score 6 and 5 Jirachi versus CL so CL has to win this for his team to bring it back let's just rewatch there were two turns of three that we missed it's a nice Mian shell balance uh, I guess he's scouting for Scarf Calder that's why he just switches out into Mongus and he just goes for yeah Spores obviously free since grass tops can be put to sleep. Oh wait, this is almost a mirror match, what the fuck? Both have a Tita, they both have a Chomp, they both have a Among Us. They both have a, not a, diff a Steel type, but two different. Uh, if Jiraji has Hazard stack though, it's gonna be really tough for CL. CL has no Hazard control. Yeah, Hazard stack is incoming. Uh, I don't know what item this is, Helmet, Shut Shell, not sure. But it's definitely not left over as we can see. Wait, the opposing among us is sleep dog, that's a wild sad. Is that specifically the switch in the spore? Harley on a fire blast, nice. So he could double into a guard chomp here if he wants to predict. The Tyranitar on the back. Or if he's like specs he can go for surf. You can also double the man show, but it doesn't accomplish that much. Not double, double the man show is a decent play, and then he can U turn out. I, f I feel like I would double the man show here, that seems like a good play. Let me just see if I. Nah, I don't want to call now. Because yesterday when I tried to call and no one picked up, like, ruined half of the coin. Yeah, he goes for serve. They didn't do much, and I assume it's for that Verachi, but. That did nothing. Not even sure if that's specs. I guess it could be specs and if it's like really bulky Rachi. Ooh, nice play by CL. Icy went on the chomp. Stop this man. Did not see that one coming. Did not see that one coming for sure. Uh, I don't think he outspeeds him with a drop unless he wants some speed, but that surf did so little that I don't know. Unless it's maybe it's only Scarf, Laddie, and he's offensive, Rachi. Now that Icy went didn't do much. If he was invested in special attack, I would do more, I think. Like maybe he's invested a little bit. But I don't think he has like a huge attack, special attack investment. Landris is a uh, good mid ground. Like, he either fire blasts or earthquakes there. She already fire blasts. Landris just works overall. Like, unless it was Draco, Life Up, Chomper. Did the Chomper show anything yet? He can just use any right? Oh, he just goes for rocks, that works. Yeah, the opposing guy from Shot Fire Blast, but. Jirachi's guard jump didn't show a move. Smackdown is interesting. I don't know if it's off plate. Was off plate all in Gen 5? I think it was. I mean, the guard jump is in now. The guard jump is now. See, I might go for Draco here if he has it. This is tough. He doesn't have. I guess he could go Mungus here if he predicts Draco. Because that would probably eat it up, and then you can pivot out into like something else next turn. Or maybe Jamungus can eat enough the combination of Draco and Fire Blast, or double Draco. Um, off play, I want to check if that item was out in Gen 5. I'm pretty sure it was. Yeah, it's a Gen 4 item. Just making sure. Ooh, yeah, I don't know why I didn't think about Earthquake, but he can obviously go for that since this Discovery is Smackdown. I mean, Laddie would have, like, Laddie could have come in there, which is why I didn't think he would do that play. Now he makes that Among Us play that I was expecting earlier. Does a shit ton, it's Dragon Gem Draco, but it still eats it up. Like, that didn't do that much considering it was Dragon Gem. Among Us ate that for quite a Among Us of fat, good god. I really hope see how I can win this. Um, finally got put in an older gen, but yeah, we'll see. Oh, the god, stop him. 
hard to run the top of it in the laddie. Okay, that Draco did a shitload. I guess that's probably Specs laddie. And it's Dark Gem Pursuit. Wow, all these gems, dude. So you're allowed to have multiple gems. It's not like... It's not like in uh, X and Y or RS where you can only have one Mega. Or like in Sun and Moon where you can only have one Zemo for one Mega. Since I never really played Black and White, I didn't know that you could have multiple gems. I guess they're not really broken because you give up your item slot for that. But it's kind of like a Z move to me. Mm, like not, maybe not as powerful, but kind of like baby Z move type of thing. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure this is the last match that I'm recording for this SBL Week Five. The, the deadline is in 4 hours, um, the Cryonicle series is still not decided, there's a doubles match that is at 4 a.m. my time that will decide the series between Cal Cole and someone else, but I don't have that knowledge about doubles and I'm not sure if I want to record that. We, we shall see, if I find some knowledge I will try. It's gonna be tough. Miyajou just picks off the Tita with a U-turn and Tia brings up the, the charm and the moves and you can just fire off fire blast here if you like. Okay, just go for earthquake. What is he trying to do? Why well, he earthquake again? What did he predict there? Predicting to go guard jump, I guess. I feel like fire blast was fine there. Oh now he misses a fire blast. That hurts because uh Skarmory would have gone too killed. Like Skarmory couldn't have stayed in, he could have pivoted the next turn, but at least it was a 50-50 then. Like between if he wants to sack this or if Sierra Boat could potentially drag or if he wants to go out into this. As it's Thunder Jirachi, Thunder Icy Wind. Who hits Thunder? Lol. <laughs> Classic Scoots, no para. And he misses. Ouch, I mean at least this doesn't die since Steel Wizard Stark in Gen 5. <laughs> Why is he 6 up by Gerard's the AB on the chat? Doesn't this have Iron Head? Did he predict them to pivot into something on Iron Head? What would the other moves be? HP ground or HP fire? Potentially. Like HP fire to hit Ferrothorn or HP ground to hit Heatran. Is that. It's not Scarf that is Roshi's first. Uh, what is this? Ta okay, it's just Rocks Ty thing. Why didn't, why didn't he get up his Rocks? Maybe, maybe he does Rocks on Jump, but I assume he's just Rocks on this. He keeps missing thunder. Missed three already. I really don't understand. Lol. Lay up stuff if you're gonna throw. Blunder in the chat. <laughs> oh, is he talking about a different game? Not sure. I think he was talking about this one. It's Tita lives an earthquake. If he had any thunder, this thing would have been arranged to dive on earthquake. I think that's a shitload, at least the expertly ev <laughs> You guys are so fucking lucky, SMH. What is he talking about? That the Landorus lived on 1%? I mean, he dodged 300. I mean, maybe he was talking about something else. <laughs> Lol. Scarf Minjo looking kinda scary. What what did the Kelly go for again turn one? Oh it, it just went for Scald and Mogus at the 15, so that's potentially Scarf Kelly. That doesn't look like specs damage to me. So he has to get rid of the Mongus and he could win with Scarf Kill if he's if he is Scarf Kill, but not sure if he's gonna be able to do that. CL's team looks like, like not completely Auras, but like a lot like Auras. 
Rocky Hammer Landers, okay, so that existed back in Gen 5. Wasn't sure if anyone used that back in the day, I just know it was used late X and Y or some somewhere around that time became a thing, or maybe mid X and Y. And then was spammed during RS, pretty sure. I mean, I guess you just you just scald here trying to burn the mongoos, right? Like, I don't see what double he can make that beats the mongoos. The mongoos kind of just walls this entire time. He has to pray he gets this burn. As, at least, at least he gets this burn. That's nice. Okay, okay nice. So this TL mongoos beats the mongoos when we won. As long as it's really important to check the Mian Chao. I guess he can just slip talk here and pull, hopefully pull HP5 if he has that. He's pulled a spot, that's nice too. <laughs> that is so lucky. They call that skill, they don't call that luck. <laughs> That was obviously sarcastic with legs. <laughs> Draco probably kills from this range. I'm not sure, but it... You can fire over Draco here, like... He doesn't have good switch in. Among Us is... Uh, okay, Fireblast is fine too. I just saw it in case he tries to good chomp with it, he could Draco. In case he tries to come in for some reason, which is probably obviously not the play. I don't know what I was thinking there. Yeah, I was actually like, I just finished rendering my the sweet bitch video, and I kind of sound a bit thick in that one because I'm not thick, but I recorded it right after I woke up. I hope the other videos I recorded today I don't sound like that. And yeah, if I don't sound like super motivated, I am still motivated to bring you guys the content. It's just I record so many videos and then at one day and sometimes maybe I lack a bit of energy because like I haven't even eaten when I recorded like the first few videos I just like woke up and immediately recorded them <laughs> oh god let's see what he pulls here oh he pulls a spore holy crap watch them say so lucky again that's so yeah that's really clutch I thought it for a second what the fuck how can you break sleep gloss but the scummy obviously died the fire blast from the chomper. Yeah. That was so important that he pulled that. I thought the Alas. Do you go for like if he has ice he went actually I'm not sure. The Mungus doesn't I don't think the Mungus gets to kill from Secret Sword or Scott. Maybe it gets to kill from Hyper Pump. Like the Mungus at 66 right with Regen, so I have to rise to the 50 something and then burn damage and sandstorm will bring it down to like high 40 percentage ish. So Fighter Pump can do like 24, 25, maybe he can kill the Mongus. Yeah, Hyder Pump has to do like 25. Ah, nice. He hits, which is important. I just want to see him win. So this is uh, 6 and 6. I mean. Um, Jirachi is on Brofist's team, if I recall correctly, so I'm kind of also rooting for them. But CL has been getting some losses, uh, I want him to get a win too. The scores, um, like, it's 6 and 6 if he wins this. Nice double into jump, gets the regenerator. This is a speed tie between both jumps, this could be. No, I think the. Me and Joe was a scarf. I don't think the job is a scarf. Nice. Um, oh, it's a life up. Okay. Picks off the kill there and. Kelly just clicks gold or hydro pump here. Like, it doesn't tweet care the Among Us. Yeah. Do you see one here? Did, 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 he, did he do it? Nice. The god. I don't think the crit mattered. The crit oh yeah, crits do double the damage in black and white. My bad guys, my bad. 
So they would have done 28. Yeah, that wouldn't have two killed. They wouldn't have two killed. So yeah, that mattered a bit. I don't know if it mattered for like if it was game deciding, because he could have still gone to chop with it on the mongoose. But it would have been really really close. Like Seal really, like in the end Seal got a bit lucky with the pulling the sleep tox bore and getting that crit on the Amungus, but earlier he got hexed a bit by missing three thunders. Not really sure how much that like if you add every hex together, I think it was kind of even, but I really don't know exactly. Yeah, Scarf Kelly just clicks gold now. That was the 100% save when he didn't want to try to miss Icy when that's why he switched out, I assume. <laughs> Hydra, please. <laughs> no, he just scores and steal wins. One of those super close, like, so close makes the series even 6 and 6. I can show you guys here. 6 and 5, and not 6 and 6 since uh, CL won this one. So, this is the first series of week 5 that is complete. Actually, that's not the first one. This one is complete. I mean, there's one game missing, one Uber's game, but Wolfpack already won the week. Was his classiest. Uh, Runas vs. Tigers is also not decided yet. But there's ADV and RBY, which I'm not really interested in, so probably not gonna record that. And Redis vs. Cryonicles is also down to the wire 6 and 5, and the doubles game is gonna decide if it's 6 6 or 7 5. And. The other series already decided five with Falcons, um, like they ran through the Sharks. There's only a little cup game left, not really too, too interesting if you guys ask me. Thank you guys for watching, there will be... Um, I might actually do like a prediction video if I like... Maybe with my friend TK or someone, I will see who I can get and call for that. Like Zam I know Zamrock does that, I don't want to like steal his idea. I mean NJNP used to do prediction videos too with with um, Ricardo for all T last year, but I, uh, they stopped doing it. Mm. I, like, I'm not sure, I would only do prediction videos for like the, the Sun and Moon and for the Aura, so it's basically the same that Zamrock already does, so I'm not sure if that's even worth it. But like, sometimes I have like a different opinion than Zamrock, like obviously, I'm not Zamrock, I don't, like, I'm not ex experienced in tournament games, I don't know that much about the tournament scene, but I have been watching SBL now every all five weeks. I have been watching a bit of last OT. I have been watching a little bit here and there World Cup on some other YouTube channels. When I didn't follow Smogon tournaments on Smog Tours myself, I didn't even know what Smog Tours was like what, two years ago or something, or one year ago. Not one year ago, probably knew about it. But I haven't followed the tournaments back then, so I didn't even know who like these tournament plays are. The only tournament I have been following is OT. Like old T2 and old T3. So, yeah, just let me know if you guys want to see that or if you have any other ideas for a series. And, yeah, like I said in earlier videos, if you want to join a video or recording, just hit me up. Like, especially if you have knowledge of a black and white DPP. And Dokuch uh, is um, here. <laughs> I don't know what I'm trying to say. Dokuch signing out is what I meant to say. Thank you guys so much for the support. And we out, we hit uh, 428 subs, I think, at the moment. So, yeah, I think that's basically around the same amount we were yesterday. I think we got like one or two new subs today. So, yeah, thank you so much for that. Smash the like button if you want to see more ulti. Um, not ulti, SPL. <laughs> ulti is in August or something. Uh, Shot on Life will be coming the next days when I get some time. And I'm out. Peace.